Katie with your Galco TV Tech Tip. It's important to maintain your variable frequency drive for maximum performance and safety. And doing so is easier than you may think. Integrating these simple steps into your preventative maintenance program can help ensure many years of trouble-free service from your drives. To maintain a VFD, there are three main factors to keep in mind. Keeping it clean, keeping it dry, and keeping the connections tight. In this video, we'll focus on keeping it dry. Keeping your VFD dry may seem straightforward at first, but there may be some environmental factors to consider that may not be entirely obvious right away. Ambient moisture should be considered in terms of both the operating environment and in your cleaning procedure. As we discussed in our previous video about keeping the drive clean, spraying compressed air into the drive may cause moisture buildup inside of the drive if the improper method is used, which can lead to eventual drive failure. You may find it useful to operate a dehumidifier close to the drive to eliminate nearby humidity. However, you will want to be mindful of where the dehumidifier and drive is mounted. Mounting the dehumidifier above the drive may seem logical, but excess water dripping from the dehumidifier into a NEMA 1 enclosure style drive can lead to enough water accumulation to corrode the circuit breaker in as few as six months. Condensation is also a factor if you are operating your VFD all day every day. The normal radiant heat emitted by the heat sink should be enough to prevent condensation. If you are not going to be operating your unit continuously, you may be better off using a NEMA 12 enclosure and a thermostatically controlled heater if condensation is likely in your environment. Check out our other videos for more tips on maintaining your VFDs and make sure to visit galco.com for all of your industrial electronics needs.